20. Gates open and they are fired away to a nice even start. Sukomaris bounced out well. Stifler's in pursuit of the early lead. Gray Stoke from an inside jump is prominent, and that now gets flushed out to race in third position. Heart of a Lion moves up into fourth. Then comes Judicial with Buffalo Bill, a rails run. One man's dream in the blue cap races in that group. Then we go a length and a half back to Dream Hunter. Aki Bua in the orange and white colors. That's racing one off the fence and about six lengths off the leader. Then we go back to Hall of Mirrors. Great music keeps that one company. Two lengths away to Twister's Path, which is now getting the shake-up call. Saltic Blue is outside of that, and then at the back end of the field is first today. They greet the judge now, 800 meters left to go. Stifler finds the lead and got a pretty easy one. It's opened up by three lengths. Second place is Sue Comaris, then comes Buffalo Bill in the silver cap, the blue sleeves, now racing about three lengths off the leader. Gray Stoke is next best, and one man's dream right in the middle of the course. Hearts of a Lion, purple sleeves and cap also begins to make up some ground. And Aki Bua to the grandstand side has got hope too, but Buffalo Bill now moves into the lead 400 meters out. Stifler down the inside seems to have no answer. One man's dream is staying on. Then further back to Hearts of a Lion and Aki Bua into the last 250. It's Buffalo Bill but in second place now one man's dream presses on. Hearts of a Lion back in third. Then comes Aki Bua and Judicial is also running a big race into the last 100 meters. Buffalo Bill hangs tough. It's a length in front. Second place is one man's dream and Buffalo Bill is going to hold them at bay. Second goes to one man's dream. Aki Bua runs third. Judicial and our catching run back in fourth. Well, we certainly opened up with a nice winner there, paying four and thirty on the tote. That's number two, a Buffalo Bill from the Gavin for Sale Stable. Well done to you, Gav. Great to see you back in the winners' enclosure. Thank you very much. It's been a while. <laughs> yeah, well, it, uh, we all go through those ups and downs. Now, a nice ride. You bounced it out, had it third back on the rails, and had a nice sit there. Yeah, they went to a good pace. I, th I think Pierre went quite a good pace for for young horses, and um, yeah, travel good the whole way. He almost made it up too well, and uh, I think a very nice horse. Yeah, I was saying that to Julian's side. Looks like he got to the front, and the other one started to come, but you kept him going, but held off the stable, mate. Yeah, thank you. Um, you know, he is, it's a little greenness once he hit the front. He yeah. was looking around and looking to run out for company, but I wouldn't for the merit. And uh, big thank you to Chesney Fanzel. Love you to ride Mr. Fanzel winner. Um, you know, him and my, my dad go back a long way, so love you to ride him a win, and uh, well done to Mr Bernard. All right, mate, how's the rest of the card look tonight? Let's hope we get through it. The rain's starting to come down. Yeah, I'm, I'm on the first time in the next drawn deep, so I think she's got a lot to yeah. do. Mm. Um, in the third race, I, I got a nice each-way chance. And, uh, you know, Turkish delights, I'm sure also in with a, with a bit of a chance. they got a hold at the weights. And... Uh, Adventure, he's been very disappointing yeah. and hoping for the best. All right, terrific. Well done. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good on you, Gav. Yep, here we go. Well done, another Gav. How you going, mate? Uh, congratulations. Um, yeah, first time out. I know you guys were very confident about this. Uh, that was on Guinea's Day, if I remember correctly, and missed the start by a couple of lengths and cost it any chance. Yeah, you know, he actually, we fancied him, but when I saw him in the ring on Guinea's Day, yeah. I said that we were in trouble. Oh. Um, he, he was carrying a little bit too much condition, oh. and um, I said to my son Chesney that, you know, sometimes you can't see that at the track and yeah. when they get here in the ring you'll see a different sort of a look about them and so you know we knew that we were in trouble in the ring because uh, he was kind of and so based on that I think that you know that the run tightened him up nicely and also the extra bit of distance and like you say he got left first time out this time he had a wonderful draw I'd like to share a little bit of a story about this was his name Buffalo Bill the, um, the owner Brian Bernard he's got a he's got a game farm and he breeds and sells buffalo as well and he came into the game like in a bit of a storm. He's only been around for a year now. Okay. And he's got a whole bunch of horses. And um, so he named this horse Buffalo Bull because everyone in racing gave him the name, the nickname Buffalo Bull because of his, um, his buffalo trading and farming you know, with game. And so this uh, means a lot to Brian Bernard to win with a horse that, uh, that's, that's called Buffalo Bull. And um, I must compliment my son Chesney on a great job here in Johannesburg once again. Right. And, and also he picked this horse for us at the sales. Okay. You know, so we were at the sales together and we were looking at horses. You know, I'll, 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 I'll do a lot of my work with Mark Terry and, and uh, we were the, uh, Brian Bernard, Buffalo Bull was with us. And, and Chesney was standing next to us. He said, come have a look at this horse. And, um, you know, he, he said, you've got to buy this horse. You know, and, and this was the horse that Chesney insisted that we buy. And Brian had to dig deep into his pocket for this horse. Yeah. And uh, he, he won a very nice race. Gavin Arena said he felt like, like he's going to go on and win a few more races. So well done to Brian Bernard. A very big well done to him. And well done to my son Chesney for both training and, and also picking him as a yearling or a two-year-old at the Ready to Run sale. He qualifies for the, for the Ready to Run stakes, yeah. this horse, which is exciting. Yeah. And uh, my owner uh, with us today is Mario Ferreira, and he ran second with uh, One Man's yes, Dream, and yes. it's Mario has also just come into the game and also hit us with a bit of a storm, yeah. and it's his first day at the races today as well. He's, he hasn't been for, in the year that
that he's had horses with us. This is the first time he's come, and um, so welcome to Mario. You know, he's happy that he's also in a very good race, and that he can look forward to a lot of fun. So it was an exciting night for us. It's a great start for us. Terrific. Well done. And uh, Buffalo Bill, you can take him home. He can actually buy another Buffalo with this one. 20,000 Rand. There we go. Thanks to Larry Weinstein from the Racing Association. It just shows for 1,100 Rand, can you believe it, you can win 20 grand? Yeah, it's a nice incentive, you know, and well done to the Racing Association for putting the money back into stakes. And yeah, you know, if, if, if you don't register, it's, 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 it's cheap at the price. 100%. Thank you very much and good luck. Thank you very much. Thanks very much to Larry Weinstein again from the Racing Association. Another 20,000 given away and what a good result there. Number two, Buffalo Bill. Hopefully you got you off to a decent start. Paid 4 and 30. Your provisional result is 2, 11, 1 and 10 for the first on the card.